Alright Shadow Mirror, so for today's life lesson, I'm going to teach you how to catch a fish. Uh, now what we're going to do is, I'm just going to start off, I'm going to shoot the fish, and what I need you to do is catch the fish once I shoot it. You got it? Okay, Shadow Mirror, that's a good boy. Alright, so let's uh, let's see here. What we're going to do is I'm going to try to line up the fish, and once it comes across, we're just going to go straight for the shop. Go straight for the... Oh god, that was a close one, but a little bit, uh, a little bit of a miss there. Okay, that was uh, a little too late. Like, get it. Oh, okay, really close there. Really, really close. Get ready, Shadow. Oh, get it ready. Oh, Shadow, Shadow Mirror, I shot it. Shadow Mirror, you gotta. You're, you're supposed to catch the. Sh Gosh, dang it, Shadow, Shadow Mirror. You were supposed to catch the fish after I shoot it. That was the game plan. Alright. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. I'm a bit disappointed. I apologize. I'm trying to teach Shadow Mirror how to survive in the wild, but. Just refuses to listen to me, Shadow Mirror. Come on, it was a pretty simple job there. I just needed you to catch the fish after I shot it, and you just stood there like a dope. Well, welcome back to our Dawn Guard Skyrim Let's Play series with Evil Ekroff, trying to impart wisdom upon my wonderful steed, Shadow Mirror. But Shadow Mirror refuses to listen, so I guess we'll just continue along our quest, which is I gotta find the Moth Priest. We're gonna follow this. There's a trail of blood over here. Oh, look, at let's follow this trail of blood, try to find the Moth Priest here. He was injured in a wreck. I must find him and do something with him. Looks like he went over here. Oh, yes, here we go, Mr. Moth Priest. All right, Shadow Mirror. Well, I hope you don't starve to death. I'm going to keep you in the shade, though, so you don't get sunburned. But you got to listen. Next time, get, pay attention to me. Next time we do those lessons, you have got to do what I tell you to. You have to listen to me. How are you going to eat if you don't catch the fish? Oh, you don't like fish? You're, ve you're vegetarian, Shadow Mirror. I am disgusted. No red-eyed beast is a vegetarian. Don't even give me that. Let's go find the Moth Priest. Okay, so creepy little mine here. Let's start off, as always, with some sneezing action. <laughs> Trying to see if we can see anything that must be seen. We got a few guys over there. Actually, a bunch of guys here. This should be exciting. All right, so let me just a uh, quick refresher here. We're looking. We're looking to capture the moth priest. I must follow Harkon's command to locate a moth priest. I followed the trail to Dragon Bridge. There, I learned that a rival band of vampires abducted the moth priest. I've been tracking, and took him to a place called Four Bears Holdout. So this is where we are. We're at Four Bears Holdout, and uh, looks like some. A rival gang of vamps? Been taking my moth priest? Are you kidding me? You can't just do that. Alright. Well then. We're gonna stay in the darkness. We're gonna stay sneaky. Stay stealthy. What is this thing anyways? It's weird looking. Someone oh, oh little puppy, these are just little cute puppies. Or what are oh, what? they're dogs. They're just regular old dogs. Well, I guess that's the end of it. So this is a cool little thing. Look, we got a little uh, vortex over there. A bunch of gargoyles doing something. Let's go check the dog. See if they've got anything. Uh, maybe they got some treats I can give to Shadow Mirror once we get out of here. That'd be good. And yeah, nothing on this one. This one's got uh, just that one. Just that one's just got an arrow. Okay. All right, let's do another sneeze here. See what we got going on right now. I wonder how many, if any, of those gargoyles will come to. Oh gosh, that was a. Faux pas. Let's try to get this guy right here. This should be a headshot. Oh gosh! It's a Dawn Guard! I thought these were supposed to be rival vampires. Was it just vampire rivals? Hmm. Well, let me go, uh. Guessing it's just gonna come right down there. Where is he? He can't see me. I'm, I'm, I'm super sneaky. But a couple of them. Interesting. Very interesting. Why you, where are you going? Which way are you going? Stand still, please. There we go. Got that guy. See, I, I don't like to do this because I, I actually plan to join the Dawn Guards. Eventually. My plan was to join the Dawn Guard, because <laughs> I hate I hate vampires. Oh, I hate those 
damn twinkly vampires. But I had to infiltrate them. They don't even know I'm trying. We're trying to be friends here. What the hell is that thing? That's a troll of sorts. Look at that thing down there. You see that? Shoot it from here. <sighs> Armored troll, huh? Hmm. That one missed. Wonder if this will hit. Oh god. Oh yeah! Look at that skill. Oh man. Force you're hiding in the shadow, shooting arrows at people who can't see you. It is skillful. It takes a high level of skill, patience, determination. All these things are required to do what I do. <laughs> Dad, please tell me that that's not skill. Listen to you, random YouTube commentator. Where are your videos, huh? Show me your skill. Oh, oh no, you just commentate? You just you just comment on videos? You just troll a lol a lol? Well, congratulations. Beckroth thinks you're an idiot. And I concur. Alright. Let's see what we got over here. I killed some fool in this vicinity. There he is. Yeah, I'm bummed out, man. I kind of just want to be friends with these Dawn Guard dudes, but they, uh... Apparently, I gotta kill them. I guess I could try just sneaking past everyone, but that sounds boring as hell. And Ekroth, well, I guess he'll just kill everything anyways, eventually. So we'll take some stuff here. We'll take some of these things here from these people. Yep, that thing there. Burnt corpse, what are these guys doing? Dawnguard. Dawnguard, I thought you guys were supposed to be like righteous and stuff. Was I wrong? Did I have a incorrect perception of the Dawn Guard? Guess we'll find out. It's pretty interesting though. Pretty interesting little scenery over here. I'm gonna take a quick gander here at the map. We're gonna go with uh Come on, what are you doing here? Where's the local? There we go, there's the local map. Okay, so that's kind of bouncing all over the place, but Alright, so we got a bunch of stuff going on around here. So this was the troll's little place. Let's go up the bridge. Let's do another sneeze, actually. This is put up a hell of a fight. Ooh. You think they turned him? I don't know. Maybe. Won't know until we get him out of here. How do we do that? I'm working on it. Now give me some silence so I can think. Okay, they're gonna split up now. That's pretty much what I need them to do. Just trying to get up on this ledge here. From the shadows is what we gotta do here. Now there's a couple of things I could do. Hmm. You know what I'm gonna do here? Check this out, guys. I'm gonna go with dagger. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to get ready to call out Shadow Cloak of the Nocturnal. Okay, ready? a stealthy while we're crouched. Someone there. Can't hide from me. Uh, actually I can. And uh, that's precisely what I'm doing. I'm invisible. Oh. Yeah to the trachea. All right, great. That worked out good. Weird friggin' lighting going on. It's actually kind of giving me a little bit of a headache. I mean, you might have to put a seizure warning on this video. Ooh, look at this. A little focus there. Vampire armor of destruction. Hmm. Meh. Search for Nick. Okay, so those guys. Now I'm supposed to deactivate this bad boy. Sleep in the coffin? Yeah, kind of busy here, buddy. That's a nice looking shield. Too bad shields are for Nancy's. All right, so let me uh, let's uh, let's let's focus here. We don't have any uh, instructions. 
on either of these guys in terms of what to do. Good thing we've got a arrow. Defeat the enthralled moth priest. Ooh. Look at this guy. I was sure I heard something. No, I don't think you did. Don't worry. Alright, moth priest. In the shadows. Dexon Evicus? Vampire seduction on the moth priest. Do I have that here? Looks like I didn't bother binding it. Okay, so we've got a uh, vampire seduction here. Yeah. That's not vampire sed. Gosh darn it. Let's try this again here. Powers. Oh, go oh gosh. I don't have to wait 24 hours. <laughs> Guess it was on cooldown. Let's see if this guy sits here for 24 hours in this position. For some reason, I doubt it, but we'll see. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm not sure what happened there. I think I just clicked Vampire Seduction and it didn't go all the way through. I don't know. Wow. Bah. I'm surprised without even casting it that it would put it on cooldown like that, but I guess that's how it works. All right. Oops, sorry. God darn it. This is really annoying. I don't understand. You gotta. There we go. Now what? Ah, feed on him. Here we go. By the divines, it's as if my eyes have been opened. I am blinded by the light of your majesty. Indeed. I... I must obey you. What would you have of me, master? I command you, travel to Castle Vokiha. Certainly. Where can I find this castle? Get a map, you idiot. It's off the northern coast of Skyrim, due west of Solitude. I will set out at once, then. Thank you. Now I've got to report my success to Harkon, huh? I know, is there anything else to discover in this uh, little area? Looks like that's probably a no. Just make sure here. That guy's running back. Looks like we got nothing else. Let me uh, check this treasure chest one last time. And yeah, stupid shield. Don't really care about that. Alright, so that was interesting. You know, Moth Priest, seduced. Creepy, I know. And check up here really quick. Is there anything fancy going on? No, not so much. Not so much. Usually there's a, uh, a quick exit out, but I guess this is a, just a small. I guess this is a small dungeon anyway, so. You know. You know the deal. <laughs> Woo! Alright, so we're gonna make our way out and uh, go report our success to. Lord Vanderbutt. I think that's his name. Maybe we'll try to do some more vampire destruction. Hmm? Let's sort of think about that. Skyrim! Here we are. Okay, so there's our buddy, Shadowmere. And uh, let's go ahead and report our success.
up this way. You know what I do want to check for? I want to see if there's any. Last time, there's some sneaky people. Hanging out outside the castle. <laughs> It's like that's not the case today. I do wonder what sort of prize I'm gonna get for seducing the mouth priest. Let's find out. Well done. Thank you. Somehow I knew it would be you and Saran. I've made the mouth priest my thrall. Yes, I see that. I trust his capture was not too difficult to task. Not at all. The Dawnguard tried to stop me, but they posed no threat. The Dawnguard were there. They fought well, but not well enough. The Dawnguard were protecting and nearly killed me. Now, let's say they posed no threat. You know, play face here. I wish I could have been there to hear the sounds of their screams. Indeed. Well, your thrall awaits, and we have given him the Elder Scroll. Surprised you Command him to read it. And let us hear the words of prophecy together. Okay. What? What what meeting? I wasn't informed of any such thing. Oh, I see. Well, I just assumed he'd sent for both of us. How awkward. Master, I have done as you asked and traveled here. Alright, new task, Moth Priest. Of course. What is it that you need me to do? You must read an Elder Scroll. Ah, yes, the Elder Scroll. I admit, I am looking forward to this. Then you may begin reading. Of course, Master. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, among the night's children, a dread lord will rise Ooh. in an age of strife. When dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. Hmm. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. All right, now I gotta talk to this guy again. He's probably just gonna tell me to go find the scrolls. That was not as useful as I would have liked. Even so, you did well. All right. Do you know where these other scrolls are, Lord Harkin? My traitor wife stole one of them away and then disappeared. As for the other, the last that I heard, it was lost in the bowels of a Dwemer ruin. It seems our work is not yet done, but I have waited this long, and we are so very close now. I can wait a bit longer. All right. for both of us. How awkward for you. So, talk to this lady. Do you have a moment to talk? Yep. What's on your mind? That moth priest, Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. I think I know where we can start looking. Okay. We didn't want that lot getting wind of it, especially my father. What? You know this guy's standing right here listening to our conversation, right? <laughs> uh, what is it between you two? Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... A means to an end. Don't say it too loud. He's kind of close. We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. All right. Sounds good. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. 
But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Hmm. Well then, sounds like she was being cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Hmm, how about right here in the castle? Wait, that almost makes sense. I used to help my mother tend a garden in the courtyard here. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Isn't that pretty risky, staying around the castle? Absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. Trust me, I lived here a very long time, and I know every nook and cranny. All right, let's do it. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. All right, let's, uh, let's stop talking and actually go do it. God, oh. Come on, it's just around the side. Oh god, these people love talking so much. Can we go outside? Okay, let's go outside. Not that I mind the story, I just... Just get to the action, please. Alright, so we're gonna go around this way. And it uh, looks like we're gonna be sneaking about here. Looking for her mum. Taking a little secret entrance out back here. She been coming? This woman, I tell ya. I tell ya. Alright. Ooh. Some people. What are these things? These are skeleton people. Hmm. Where's the entrance up top? All right. Whoop. Oh God. Did they spot her? Oh my frick. What is this lady doing? What the heck? She ruined everything. <laughs> I was trying to sneak in stealthily and she goes and gets herself spotted. Darn headshots on this thing. Finally hidden again. Look at she's sprinting now. That is the opposite of what we were trying to do here, Serena. I'm just disappointed, that's all. I thought she could be stealthy. Guess she can't hang, huh? She can't hang with the true stealth master. Sniping from the shadows. Where'd you come from? All right. Well, thanks for nothing, there, Serena. You uh, really helped out tons there. Good job. Uh, I should have just taken them out to begin with. To be honest with you, I just thought she could have thought she could hang with me, but I guess not. I guess not. Yeah, let's go to the Undercroft here. See if we can find this lady. 
Okay, so... <laughs> that was good. Alright. I don't... We're in the we're, we're in the castle. I'm surprised. See, this is the thing. I, I thought this was just going to be straight up stealth mission. I didn't think we'd have to be killing these things. Uh, because of the fact that, you know, we're... Again, we're in her castle. Like, I guess it's good, good though. This is kind of what I want to do. Take out all these uh, stupid vampire and vampire things. On some days, this would smell just... I'm glad you weren't here then. How you doing, puppy? Okay. So. Oh, someone's coming. There we go. Where'd you come from? For a feral vampire. Huh. There we go. Done and done. Excellent. And I think this is Serena's... Yeah, it's Serena's friend there. Alright, journal fragment, good. Pick that up. Nice ring of destruction there. Don't need that, really. Well, this is, uh, this is strange. I, again, I didn't, uh, I really didn't think I would have to be killing in this adventure. I, again, I'm not disappointed at all. I'm actually, uh, pretty thrilled. Because she is helping me destroy the vampires. Technically speaking, at least. Anything over here for me? Those look cool, but... That's about it. Read that. Nothing, nothing doing. Search the barrel. Try this. Opens up. Okay. Good. Perfect. Take a look. This is one of those weird double barred security measures that my father put in when he got one. Alright. That skeleton. Got a skeever over there. No one. Necklace, I'll sell. Oh, oh, that's, <laughs> that's her friend, right? <laughs> Careful there, Get some spikes. Is this really anything, though? No? I guess not. Alright, never mind then. No one actually looks like my, uh, my bow's a little, a little toasted here for a minute, so let's, uh, take care of that. Weapons? Blade of Woe is alright. Let's charge this up, though. Ah, so that's just the pit down there? Okay. Fair, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> just the pups, I think. Okay. Check these shelves here. Any books worth reading? No? Serena, I've been noticing you really haven't been doing a lot, and anytime you do something, it's kind of bad. 
You plan on being helpful at any point? Yes. What did you need? Hmm. Wow, there's a lot I can say to her. Whoa. This better not be all the things you just can't be bothered with. No, that's exactly what it is. I can actually give her stuff? Nice. Oh, that's amazing. No, I'm trying to sell this. Don't equip that, you idiot. Oh, I just give her stuff. She's not giving me money for it. Oh well, whatever. I can't wait to see the courtyard again. Okay. I was really excited there for a minute. I thought she was gonna buy stuff from me. It's really so annoying to get rid of inventory in this game. And try to make gold at the same time. Since freaking like every every darn vendor has like 700 gold, which is <laughs> pretty much a single item that you can sell. It gets really annoying really quick. Oh boy, nice and easy. As a result, nothing of value. Oh. Who's there? A dead spider. Could you imagine getting trapped in this room? <laughs> With that thing? No thank you. That sounds horrendous. What did that open? Ah, lower the bridge. Back around. Excellent. Excellent. All right, let's go back. Yes, what did you need? Nothing. Go back and across that bridge now. It's lowered. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And this leads out to the courtyard. Yes. Head for the door. That's where we're going. Oh yeah, we're getting there, guys. We've made it to the courtyard. What's the matter? What is it, Serena? What happened to this place? Everything's been torn down. The whole place looks... well, dead. Well, it's you like guys are vampires. Set foot here in centuries. This used to lead into the castle's great hall. It's like my father had it sealed up. I used to walk through here after evening meals. It was beautiful once. Hmm. What was this? This was my mother's garden. It... Do you know how beautiful something can be when it's tended by a master for hundreds of years? She would have hated to see it like this. Wait. What? a sundial, right? Where are you going? Something's wrong with the moon dial here. Some of the crests are missing and the dial is askew. I didn't even know the crests could be removed. Maybe my mother's trying to tell us something. All right. Oh. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. So we must find the missing pieces.
trying to I'm trying to place these missing pieces. I swear to you, I've picked one up. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. Yeah, I know. I heard you. Right, I'm gonna try to find all of them, I guess. And then we will place them. up here at least. No? I have three. The one over here. Is that it? There's something strange with Oh, there it is. Very clever, mother. Very clever. I've never been in those tunnels before, but I bet they'd run right under the courtyard and into the town. Huh, this is kind of neat. Let's see what's uh underneath. Let's see what's behind door number one. Ooh. Coin purse. I've never even seen this part of the castle before. Be careful. I don't know what might be around. Oh, these guys are alive. Way to draw attention. Way to draw lots of attention. Yes. All right. That was sweet. She reanimated one of them. I'm not gonna bother checking them all. Like we're going this way. Gargoyle. Angry. What? I knew I heard something. <laughs> Gargoyle. Oh, you're so easy to kill. Bunch of amethyst. Some of that. Problem. Now you're running into the spikes. This girl's super smart, guys, let me tell you. Where'd you come from? now. <laughs> Whoopsie. Finish him off. Or don't care about. Got 
some arrows, though. There's another gargoyle right there. Is it gonna pop up or what? This place is spooky. Loop. Loop. Who's there? I knew I heard something. Are there more though? Yes. No, it was just him. Okay, lady, let's keep going. Skeleton taken care of. Don't know why I picked that up. Looks like we've got one more gargoyle right there and a little thing right behind him. So come on alive. Come on. Wake you up. Wakey. Wakey, wakey. Eggs and bakey. Nothing, huh? Who's there? That'll teach you. Let's see if uh There it is. Where'd you come from? Holy heck. This guy is pissed off. What are you doing? Why am I? What the heck was that? Did you guys see that? Yeah, that's that didn't make any sense to me either. But it happened. So what did that activate? Was it just him? Or was there something on the other side? The store was already open. Get out of my way. Go down here. Oh, nothing's responding well. There it is. Okay. Things were uh, bugged out for a moment there. My apologies. Just tell me to go down here, though. This can't be right. This cannot be right. I didn't think so. Oh, you know what I need? Is this the one?
serious? Is it this door? Try pulling that chain once more because I think I may have deactivated it after activating it. I don't know if this is right. I think my clairvoyance may be busted. Gosh darn it. <laughs> On my way, lady. I hate you. I have explored it. I've explored it to the best of my abilities. I activated the pull chain, and I've continued to explore. Oh, there it is. Wow. I know. I hate myself too. But we're here, and that's all that matters. We're here together. That's all that matters. These things are beastly. Oh, I shot her. That's bad. Dudes, with gargoyle brutes. Let's see if we can find this one here. Oh gosh, keeps breaking. Come on. Come on. Lots of stuff. Oh, that's neat. A little hunting bow and stuff. Take that, just because it's shiny. Bunch of weapons, a couple of seats. Hello. Okay, so. <laughs> Freak him out. They're like, hey, where's that noise? Who's there? Done and done.
Is that your mom? I'm guessing not. Well, lady, I don't know where your mom is. I don't think we found her. That's where I was before. I just went in the, uh, just went in another entrance, basically. It's like an alternative means of getting there. So I'm gonna guess then that we should go across this way. Take a look over here. There we go. So much to see. Man, their castle's huge. I don't believe this for one minute. They never knew about all these rooms. The gargoyle. Which of you will come to life? See you. Just gonna walk by all of them. There's one. Oh yeah. Where'd you come from? Okay. This is getting ridiculous. Just supposed to wait for all these guys to show up here. the top yet. Ooh. I bet there's some kind of secret passage around here. So, secret passage. It's the kind of thing I'm great at finding. Room freaks me out just a little bit. Sit. Look at this place. This has to be it. I knew she was deep in the necromancy. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Well then. Well then, indeed. Looks like we found a. Uh... She must have spent years collecting these components. And what's this thing? I'm not sure about this circle, but it's obviously a something. Yeah, very astute. It is obviously something. Look at all the stuff for the taking. This is where she did her rituals. Looks like we're gonna have to fill the portal vessel, and of course we will do that. In the next episode. Well, this is a this was a pretty interesting episode. I've just uh, yeah, I've just been intrigued. There's some cool stuff going on here. We found her mother's necromancy room, and as you can see, there's a whole ton of stuff. I'll be taking most of it, at least anything I find useful, like this. <laughs> and when we get back, uh, we'll figure out what the next Let's step take is. A look around. Oh. There has to be something here that tells us where she's gone. Yes, I'll do that next time. My mother was meticulous about her research. If we can find her notes, there might be some hints in there. Don't look through your mother's journal. I remember you... she used to keep a small journal. 
See if you can dig it up. That is just wrong. That is just wrong. Looking at your mother's things. Keep searching for her notes. She probably had a journal or something. I refuse. I'm gonna sit down here and let you do that dirty work. I'll see you guys next time. Keep watching and keep owning. I mean, stay stealthy. It's that Groff after all. That creep looking through her mother's things.